this next thing up with a UMB number two to make UMB number three. And put this together with this. And there it is. The V Jolt. Okay. So now that empty bottle is pretty much useless. Those two empty bottles are pretty much useless, so we're gonna stash that into the trunk. And stop by. I might as well put the ink ribbons there too. Yeah, let's stop by the trunk first, because I want to go directly to uh, Plant 42. We're going to start kicking his ass. And yeah, since plants are susceptible to flame, it shouldn't take a while to kick his ass. Yeah. Another over-the-gun moment there. Uh, he had he thought that uh, putting the vigil on the root will um, take it down. Take it down for sure, but it turns out he still had to fight the fucker. <laughs> and that was a, that was a pretty decent play, for me, though, right? I'm not knocking OTG in any way, but yeah, yeah. That's one thing I like. That's one thing I like about OTG, and it sort of inspired me to do my own playthrough. This is because uh, <laughs> because whenever whenever some bands he gets hit, he like he basically loses it. He's like either he's like either saying give up or uh, basically go goes a little tired. Basically gets pretty annoyed. He doesn't get like pissed, but he gets annoyed. <laughs> and it's funny when he gets annoyed when uh, things usually don't go as they are planned, which is common in video games. There's a ladder, will you descend it? Of course I will, you dumb fuck. Why do you think I'm going down it, you flip? Damn donut. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy. Let's get back to work here. We're gonna head back to that room with the uh, root. Rain is still flopping around. I'd pretty much leave him for dead. No, wait, no use uh, putting a freaking uh, grenade around. Yep, and there's the plant 42 root. It looks like a plant root. <laughs> Here you go. Bon appetit. And the plant root is withered and withers away. There's a bag here, nothing useful inside. God damn it. Yeah, I think they put some valuable in there if the root's blocking them. Okay, now that we root weakened the root. Now that we will to the root, let's go kick Plant 42's ass. And we all know the protocol here. If there's any note, the empty bottle isn't there. There's a ladder, will you climb it? Of course I will, you damn donut. Alright, it's full speed ahead to Plant 42. And since for some silly reason I can't reload my grenade launcher, yes, from now from here on out I'm going to call it grenade launcher because it looks like a grenade launcher, but they call it bazooka. Bazooka's a fucking R it's a freaking uh, RPG, come on. You know your difference. Alright, so, let's go say hi to Plant 42.
Hello there, your pet fuck. <laughs> Wait a minute, why can't I combine it? What is this bullshit? And there is the helmet key. He still won't really reload that. Yep. I wonder who's going to do that. That plant's eulogy. You know what? Maybe I should do the eulogy. Today we we mourn the passing of Plant 42, which grew from a from a typical garden weed, and now he will rest in peace or rest in pieces. <laughs> oh no, bad joke. I gotta do it. Sorry. Ow! That stings. Okay, carving of a helmet. That's the helmet key that's been elusive for the whole game so far. But we still gotta run from these goddamn bees. But we save on the flame rounds, and of course I use a lot of explosives. Oh, oh gunfire. Wesker. Oh, Wesker. Jill. So you're safe. You got any spare That's build build frame? I, was I need going to straighten to out my bangs. Where on earth have you been? You disappeared from the hall all of a sudden. I'm sorry, but I have my reasons. Perhaps you guys it's have met magic. them. It was all I could do it's to protect myself special. against those strange creatures. Is that right? Anyway, it's good to see you're safe. Jill, our first priority is to get out of here. Get at him. Yes, you're right. You know what's funny about Wesker? Hold on. Now, there are a lot of rooms in that mansion that we can't get into because they're locked up. I have been looking around for clues. Okay. I'll go to the other house and see if I can find any clues. Will you do that? I'm counting on you. Ugh. That dialogue makes me want to cringe. Ah! Bees! No wonder. Well, that's what he was shooting at. Come on. Thank you. Anyway, as I was saying, you know the funny thing about Wesker? It's this. In the later Resident Evil games, he somehow gains a British accent. I don't know why. I guess it's the influence of the tea virus that made him change his accent or something. He went from he went from sounding like this, like uh, Donnie Mike from UWO, to all of a sudden a little passion voice, like uh, like he's like he's from uh, from the from better stock in England. No, no offense to my England fans here. Okay, let's see here. Uh, well, we basically came out there more or less without a scratch, but we're going to take out some explosive rounds. The reason being, now's the time we need them. Yes, it is. So we're going to take all the freaking grenade rounds out, except for the acid rounds. They'll come later. And for my sidearm... We're gonna bust out the shotgun. Take the shells too. Let's do a little combining here. You know what? Fuck that. We'll just we'll just put put it with the uh... And that leaves very little inventory space. So you know what? I think we have to check them first. Powerful launcher for the bazooka, okay. Or grenade launcher. 
Still won't let me reload him. Still won't let me load him in, you bastard. Ugh. But... In any case... Buff down an increment and save. Yeah. <laughs>